I want to show you something really cool. This is a new Chinese stealth fighter called the J-50. Also referred to in some circles as the JXDS prototype. And it is one of China's most ambitious forays into the future of aerial combat. This is a cutting-edge fighter jet that signals the dawn of sixth-generation fighter capabilities. So, let me tell you everything we know about it, while still shrouded in secrecy. The emerging details and visual leaks point to an aircraft that pushes the envelope in low observability. Intelligent systems integration and multi-role versatility. This aircraft is on the just an evolution of the J-20. It appears to be a clean sheet design aimed at surpassing the limitations of fifth generation fighters. The J-50 is a testament to China's rapid progress in aviation technology. Emerging reports and analysis indicate that this prototype boasts a level of stealth and capability that rivals or even surpasses some fifth generation fighters already in service. One analyst estimated that the J-50 might have a radar cross-section as low as 0.001 square meters, placing it in the same ballpark as America's top secret. Next generation air dominance or NGAD fighter, such a small radar signature would make detection incredibly challenging, even for advanced Western radars. Visually, the J-50 is characterized by a sleek, tailless delta configuration. This radical departure from traditional control surfaces isn't just about aesthetics, it's about function. The removal of vertical stabilizers and the adoption of a blended wing body layout significantly reduce the aircraft's radar cross-section. This is especially important given the growing sophistication of anti-ship missiles and the threat they pose to Chinese assets. By minimizing its radar signature, the J-50 makes itself extremely tough to detect and lock onto. The benefits extend to both low-frequency and high-frequency radar systems, giving the jet a significant edge in terms of survivability to further bolster its stealth profile. The aircraft reportedly features a serrated leading edge on its wings and an S-shaped intake duct design. These features minimize radar returns by scattering electromagnetic waves, confusing the enemy's targeting systems. Additionally, the airframe is said to be covered with advanced radar-absorbent materials and composites that absorb and dampen radar energy rather than reflecting it, effectively making the jet invisible to enemy radars. The J-50 Stealth is more than skin deep. Its entire design is sculpted around reducing observability in every aspect, including thermal and infrared signatures. To achieve this, the aircraft is believed to incorporate an array of measures such as heat dissipation, channels, heat shielding, and advanced cooling systems. These measures not only helped maintain low surface temperatures, but also prevent the aircraft's hot exhaust from being visible to infrared sensors. Moreover, the J-50S engines are fitted with vectoring nozzles that allow for precise control over exhaust plume direction by carefully managing the plume's direction and using specialized nozzles. The aircraft can effectively hide its infrared signature from enemy detection systems. At the heart of the J-50 lies its propulsion system. One of the key differentiators in this 6th generation fighter. 
while the exact engines remain unconfirmed. Speculation points to a pair of next generation WS-19 engines or possibly an upgraded WS-15 variant. These engines aren't just powerful, they are also designed for efficiency, enabling thrust vectoring for enhanced maneuverability. The anticipated performance of these engines underscores the J-50's potential for supercruise. The ability to cruise at supersonic speeds without afterburners, a hallmark of sixth generation fighters. Supercruise capability is a testament to the advancements in jet engine technology and aerodynamic design. By eliminating the need for afterburners, the J-50 can maintain high speeds while reducing its own thermal signature and conserving fuel. This is particularly advantageous in combat scenarios where sustained high-speed pursuits or strikes are involved. Maneuverability is another key aspect of the J-50's design. The aircraft's thrust vectoring nozzles enable it to perform extreme aerial maneuvers, making it a formidable force in close quarters dogfights. This is made possible by the ability to direct the engine exhaust not just forward, but also upward and downward, providing unprecedented levels of control. Such maneuverability gives the pilot the edge they need to outmaneuver opponents, and gain a positional advantage in combat. But the J-50's capabilities go beyond just raw speed and stealth. It carries a substantial payload capacity, enabling it to fulfill a variety of mission profiles. Internally, the jet is designed to house advanced sensors and electronic warfare suites giving it the ability to gather intelligence and disrupt enemy communications and radar. Additionally, the aircraft is rumored to possess onboard systems for electronic warfare, including the capability to detect, identify, and neutralize incoming threats like radar-guided missiles. This makes the J-50 not only a potent offensive platform, but also a force multiplier in electronic warfare scenarios. One of the most intriguing aspects of the J-50 is its cockpit. The aircraft is believed to feature an AI-assisted cockpit featuring wide area panoramic displays, advanced head-up displays, and helmet-mounted interfaces. This integration of artificial intelligence into the cockpit is a step toward reducing pilot workload and enhancing situational awareness. The idea is that AI algorithms assist in sensor fusion, threat identification, and real-time battlefield awareness, allowing the pilot to focus on making critical decisions. The J-50 is not intended to operate in isolation. It's a central node in China's network-centric warfare doctrine. That means it can seamlessly share data with ground units, satellites, and other aircraft, creating a web of interconnected assets. Notably, the J-50 is expected to play a pivotal role in coordinating swarms of loyal wingman drones, a capability that amplifies the aircraft's overall effectiveness. This networked approach allows for a distributed and collaborative style of warfare, leveraging the strengths of each asset in the network. Armament-wise, the J-50 is expected to carry a flexible mix of long-range air-to-air missiles, high-speed anti-radiation missiles, and precision-guided munitions. All these weapons are designed to maximize the J-50's stealth and multi-role capabilities.
the aircraft's internal weapon bays ensure that its stealth profile is maintained even when armed, a testament to the aircraft's design philosophy. The potential for laser or microwave-based defense systems further enhances the aircraft's offensive and defensive capabilities. Such directed energy weapons could be used to engage incoming threats or even provide cover for friendly aircraft. This would give the J-50 a significant edge in air to air combat scenarios. The J-50 embodies a paradigm shift in aerospace engineering. It's not just an advancement in fighter jet technology, but a blueprint for the future of aerial platforms. Its modular architecture allows for rapid upgrades in sensors, software and propulsion components, ensuring that the airframe remains relevant and adaptable throughout its service life. Another notable feature is the aircraft's stealthy communication suites. The J-50 is believed to utilize low probability of intercept LPI data links and encrypted communication lines, allowing secure and resistant coordination even in contested environments. This is crucial for maintaining command and control over the aircraft and its potential drone wingmen, ensuring mission success even under heavy electronic warfare opposition. As China continues testing and refining the J-50, the full extent of its capabilities will become clearer. But even at this prototype stage, it's evident that the JXDS concept marks a bold leap in aerospace design and strategic doctrine. Whether or not it eventually enters mass production, the J-50 offers a glimpse into what the future of air dominance may look like a blend of stealth, intelligence, and system-level warfare. What do you think? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.